ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Loop of Destiny. I am Byron Rogers, an author, speaker, and an empowerment strategist, and the principles that I'm going to teach in this video are designed to help you tap into and unlock the power of your total conscious mind. These are principles that you've used to create the life that you have, but I want to show you how to use these same principles to create the life that you want. If this video resonates with you, I want to encourage you and empower you to follow the link beneath this screen and or the one that appears after the video and to get in the loop of destiny with me so I can literally personally work with you through my virtual coaching platform. I can send you a video one time per week and literally answer your questions and work with you to get you on your way to your own bigger purpose, destiny, and future. So until the next video, I want you to find your purpose, live with passion, and reach your destiny. Thank you. As a human being, you have three levels of consciousness. Your super conscious, your focal conscious, and then your subconscious faculties. And these are moving, are, are the different degrees and ways that you're moving through your life. Your subconscious is driving you. Your willful volitional conscious is like the little rudder on the ship that's trying to steer here and, and, and there. And it's, it's, it's your, the level of discipline that you have. You can change things to a degree, but why can't you stop yourself from eating ice cream late at, light, late at night, no matter how much you know it's bad for you and no matter how bad you want to lose weight? Okay, that's subconscious. Uh, so that's subconscious action overpowering your willful, intelligent, logical, conscious faculty. And this is why we recreate situations in our life. We get stuck. Okay, so and then you have your intuition, your serendipity, your 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 higher level of intelligence. Okay, that's your super conscious faculty. Your so as a human being, what how this becomes relevant is you're actually a three part being as well, and these different levels of consciousness are embedded in three different levels of your being. They they they're they're different manifestations of these levels of consciousness. Now, your focal conscious, willful conscious mind is obviously your physical body. This is the way that we interface and interact with this world. But the other two faculties of your consciousness, your subconscious to begin with, is what has been referred to uh, since man's almost been on this planet as your soul. Your soul, science would say your subconscious mind is every decision you've ever made, the, is the sum total of every decision you've ever made and every emotion you've ever felt and everything that's ever happened to you. And that subconscious mind is the programming for all of that that holds that and makes decisions to protect you emotionally. But then, but then spirituality would say that your, your subconscious, your subconscious is your soul and your soul is the thing that is the composite of every decision you've ever made, everything that's ever happened to you, your truest and most, the, the most authentic and the real character of you that you are creating as you go through your life. So you need to make decisions that are going to save your soul, that are gonna help you transmute your soul so that it's either dark or light at the end, right? You need to save your soul through decision. And that is what spirituality would tell you, okay? But when you look at both of these together, you see that science and spirituality are saying the same thing. Your soul is your your soul is the level of consciousness of your super your 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 soul is a level of consciousness of your subconscious mind. And as you move up, your volitional willful consciousness is your physical body, the consciousness of your physical body, the one that you use to navigate and walk through the physical world. And your spirit my friends, is the level of your super conscious faculty. So as you move up and you look at, well, what's been going on in my life? When do I get intuition? That's your spirit trying to speak with you. Your spirit, your super conscious faculty is up at 100 feet. It, it, it is connected to everything and it knows everything and it is a higher level of intelligence. That's why when you willfully try and figure something out and you sit there and you're working on it, working on it, you're stumped, you're completely stumped, but you get up and you walk away and you relax your mind and you're like, you know, making, making a sandwich, all of a sudden, you're, the answer just comes to you. Just, the answer just comes to you. Because the higher level of intelligence within you, your super conscious faculty, when your mind relaxed, was able to step in 
and give you a hint or give you the, even the answer itself. This superconscious faculty is the thing that has caused everything that humankind has done amazing to come from the conceptual realm of things that are just a thought into the physical realm of things that are real. If you look in the room around you right now, you're going to see chairs, tables, uh, there's lights, everything around you at one point in time was in the conceptual world. And then through inspiration and through tapping into higher levels of intelligence that we had readily available to us at that point in time, we got the ideas and the frameworks and the intelligence to be able to create these things in order to translate them into boom the physical realm so everything that's here with us while we're hanging out on this planet and while we're creating has been created two times everything so that is essentially the way that that this world works and the way that our lives work and your superconscious faculty that's is your inspiration it is your intuition it is your, your, the thing that knows what and who you are. That's when you relax your mind and you accidentally drift off and find yourself daydreaming. What is that? That's your spirit. That's your superconscious faculty showing you what you can be, showing you who you truly are, showing you what can be if you can do one thing, if you can get yourself off of the code of understanding and get yourself onto the code of, 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 of faith. So as we, as we look at your life, like when, you, when, you, when you're sitting there and, and a car drives by and it's a really nice car and you're like, man, I really want one of those and you know you deserve one, you know that deep down that's you, man. You have that in you to get that. It's not like you're thinking, oh, I wish. No, you really know that that could be you, that that's you. That's your spirit being like that is you. We just need to get you on the plane of that, make that a reality and we can. And I'll talk to you more about how to do that in a second. Hello ladies and gentlemen and I really hope that you were enjoying that video you were just watching. It's actually just a small excerpt, a clip from what I call the loop of destiny which is simply a way for you and I to work together. It's, it's a way for me to send you a full length video every single week and literally to coach you on the implementation of the principles within the video. Principles designed to help you raise your level of consciousness and to use Use the skills and abilities that you've already used to create the life that you have, but to use those with deliberation, purpose, in order to create the life that you want, the life you know is yours, the life that you know you're capable of. So if that's interesting to you, if, if learning how to use your entire conscious mind is something that you love to learn more about, I want to encourage you to just check out the link beneath this screen or the link that will show up on the screen after the video. and. Let's work together. Allow me to help get you on the path to your own greater destiny, purpose, and future. Get in the loop of destiny with your own destiny, and let's work together. So until then, until the next video, I want to encourage you to find your purpose, to live with passion, and to reach your destiny. Thank you.